What's happening guys, my name is Amit and if you are subscribed to my YouTube channel, you would have seen the unboxing of my Asus i7 laptop I did a few months ago. Here's a link to it if you somehow missed it. Now I've been using this laptop for a while now and of late decided to upgrade its stock hard drive with an SSD instead. In this video, I'm going to show you the safest and the easiest way to install an SSD on the Asus X550 L series of laptops. To begin with, the first thing we need to do is clone the internal hard disk. I used Transcend's own cloning software to clone my hard disk image onto this SSD. Since I made use of a USB 2.0 enclosure for the SSD, it took me around 45 minutes to complete the process. Once cloned, shut down your laptop and remove the external battery. Once the battery is removed, open the laptop's lid and keep the power button pressed for a few seconds to remove any leftover static charge. Now to remove the back cover that houses the hard drive and RAM modules of this laptop, we'll need to unscrew two screws as shown here. A regular Phillips screwdriver should do the trick. Once unscrewed, simply slide the cover downwards and lift it from the bottom to reveal the hard drive compartment. Since we'll not be working on the RAM modules in this video, let me zoom into the hard drive area. Here, as you can see, we'll need to remove a total of three screws keeping the hard drive in place. The one on the top is a little naughty, so be careful. Now all you gotta do is slide the hard drive backwards and it should come off easily. Lift it from the tape and remove it. As you can see the hard drive is enclosed in a metal enclosure which we'll need to remove and use it with the SSD. This enclosure is kept in place with four tiny screws on the sides. Once unscrewed, pull out to detach the hard drive from the enclosure and keep it somewhere safe. The SSD I'll be using in this video is a 128GB SATA 3 SSD that I unboxed a few days ago. Insert it facing downwards with the logo up to align with the screw holes on the side. Now use the same screws to connect it to the hard drive enclosure. Please note I had already cloned the SSD with my hard drive before installing it into the laptop. I suggest you to do the same. Once done, place the SSD enclosure in the compartment and slide it inwards towards the laptop SATA controllers. Screw the enclosure into the compartment and then place the plastic cover back on and tighten it using its respective screws. Snap the battery back in its place to complete the process. That's about it, you've successfully installed an SSD into this ASUS laptop and are ready to go. If you'd like to see a comparison of the boot up timings of this laptop while on a conventional hard drive and this SSD, please follow the link on your screen now. I hope this video is useful to you, please hit the like button if it was and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Till then, cheers.